Hey there, Chad Bonger here for Ohio University Libraries. If you're looking to do international market research for a particular consumer product category, you'll definitely want to check out the dashboards feature in Passport. This allows you to visually kind of hone in on some hot international markets for your consumer product category and then find additional in-depth information for that particular product category for your, for your international market. So here's how you use those dashboards in Passport. So here you go. So when we first get to Passport, we're going to scroll down, and if you're on a small monitor, this may be uh, under the fold there. So we're going to select our industry, and because I'm doing luxury handbags or, or luxury leather products, I'm going to look under luxury goods. You may have to kind of point and click and try to find your best product category. This is going to load the luxury goods dashboard where we get a good global view of the overall market, and we can change this to a more uh, narrow product category such as luxury leather goods to kind of tackle my luxury handbags question. If you want to look at a particular country, we just click on the country and we can click on explore more in detail to get additional statistics on that particular country. So here we see that Australia is number, ranked number 19 in the world according, according to market size. And we also see some of the top three companies that have the top market share in the product category. We can also change the category and look at the channel view. So this is looking at store-based purchases of leather, leather goods. We can also look at internet sales of leather goods for each particular region. So it's a great way to look at information regarding where people are buying their product. Clicking on the analysis button next to the country will open up additional information. And here we have a country report for leather, luxury leather goods in Australia that gives you analysis, data graphics, as well as related reports. If we look at the company view, we can see particular companies and their sales throughout the world. And we can go in and change the company to some of the key players in that particular industry or market. We can look at a bar chart to see sales throughout the world. And this kind of information can be downloaded in a PowerPoint slide or PDF format, or you can take a picture as well. So hopefully this video helped you better understand how to use the Passport's uh, dashboard feature. If you need more help, look for the contact link on the business blog. There's more videos there as well as more videos on YouTube. So take care and best of luck your research.